Hey guys, um, I just, since I made the, um, the handmade gifts video, I figured I would make, um, a bot gifts video. And I wanted this video to be different than the ones that I've been watching because I feel like if it's different, you know, maybe use it on different genders. And I just, I didn't want to have like what I've been watching a few, um, gift videos. And if you watch one, you watch them all, honestly. They've had Uggs, they've had the AirPod Pro Max headphones. I'm not a hater of any of those things. They just don't really go with my style. Um, and also, I don't really think that the AirPod Pro Maxes are pretty. Not that it matters, I guess, what they look like, but I think they're ugly as hell. I'm gonna start with clothing. Um, I'm starting with the Reebok Class Cs. I think that's what they're called. Um, I actually have a pair. I got them from Urban Outfitters. The link will be in the description. They're very comfortable. Um, yeah. And then the next one is the Be A Nice Human shirt. It's from um, Earthbound and um, it's so nice. Like I got it for my mom for her um, birthday. No, 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 not for her birthday. For Mother's Day, I got that for my mom. And she loves it, she wears it all the time. Um, the only sucky thing about the Earthbound website is you can only use a credit card. And I don't have a credit card, so I had to give Ryan the money to pay for it on his credit card. So it's pretty inconvenient, honestly. The next one is something I own too. It's the Salvatore Brothers hoodie, not hoodie, sweatshirt. It is so cute. It's very comfortable too. I actually was gonna wear it in this video and I put it on and I was too warm, honestly. I get hot so easily. So yeah, that's why I'm not wearing it. Um, the next thing I have is a Carhartt beanie. I think that they're so cute, honestly. I used to not like how it had the tag on it. Not the tag, but like the logo on it. But now I think it's actually pretty cute, so yeah. Um, the next thing is my Nirvana hoodie. I wore it in one of the videos back. It's really cute. I got it at Hot Topic. Um, yeah. And then, um, Next is a Led Zeppelin shirt. Actually, no, I'm not gonna get it. Um, it's from this brand that I've totally been gatekeeping since 2014. Um, it's called Liquid Blue, the website. And they have such cool shirts, like band shirts, uh, tie-dyes. They're beautiful shirts. And I've been hiding them for as long as I can remember, honestly. Cause like, I didn't want, I wanted to be different. I wanted to wear all these cool shirts and I didn't want anybody copying me. I know, dick move. Um, but yeah, that's just how I felt. But now I'm a little bit much more mature, so I guess I'm gonna share it. Um, the next thing is a fedora. I have two fedoras. Um, one's beige, one's black. I feel like you can never really go wrong with a fedora. Um, the one I'm showing is on Amazon. I got my two at Walmart, actually. Um, they're a little small, though. But, I mean, it's a fedora. Who cares? Um, the next thing is a cap. I have, like, a million dad caps. Like, I'm calling them dad caps. One of mine actually says dad. But, um, just caps. Like, baseball caps. Uh, this one's really cute. It's on Amazon. Um, the next thing is warm socks. They're on Amazon too, because I mean, you know, you can wear them with your boots and everything like that. Um, the next thing is slippers. I know, like I would put the smiley face slippers on here, but I looked at Amazon and, um, they're not rated very well. Like the, the ones that I picked are rated really well. They're not like cute, cute but I assume that they're good quality because they're rated really well. Um, the next thing is Hoka's. I didn't pick a pair. Um, I don't think I picked a pair if I remember correctly. I think I just added the link to the site. Honestly, I'm really not sure. There might be a pair picked, but you know. Um, the next shirt is a Gunther shirt from Friends. I've been wanting this shirt for years and since I found it on Etsy I was like that's pretty reliable 
I think it's got like a 4.9 star or like a five star. It's one of those. And um, so it's good quality. That's what matters. Basically my whole list is good quality items because I will not like, um, I will not represent something that's not good quality. Okay, the next one after that is from Etsy as well. And it's a Guy Fieri shirt. And it is hilarious. Like, cause my boyfriend used to not like Donner Stravins and Dives and I made him watch it. And he was like, it's actually not that bad. So we have like this Guy Fieri kind of love. Um, yeah, that's the last thing on the clothing um, section. Next is electronics. The first one I have is the Canon G7X Mark II. I would put the Mark III on there, but they really, it doesn't have good reviews at all. The, um, the Mark II has good reviews. So that's why it's on the list. I don't have one. I'm filming with my phone. Um, which, I mean, it's good enough, you know, like, I'm happy enough with it, so that's what I'm, that's what I'm going to keep using. This one is an iPad Pro 11 inch, and I actually am reading from mine right now. My, um, my gift list is on there, and, um, so that's why I'm not showing it to you. The next thing is an Apple Pencil. My Apple Pencil is currently in the case of my iPad. Um, the next thing is Bose headphones. Um, where did I put my, oh, they're right here. I love these things. They're so comfortable. I've had mine since 2018 and they're still holding strong. Um, I like them a lot better than the AirPod Pro Maxes. I just think they're prettier, honestly, but also they might work better. I really don't know. Uh, the next thing is a Kindle. Ignore that. This is my Kindle. I love it. I read from it all the time. I actually was on a break from reading for a while and then I just started reading again yesterday. And um, I, I finally finished The Spaniards Love Deception and I started Credence yesterday, the day before. And everybody talked about how bad Credence was and how like smutty it was. I still don't feel like it's that bad, honestly. Like, maybe I got too used to it in the Spanish love deception and are not so me cute, but I don't know. I don't think it's that bad. I, I really don't know. I just, maybe I'm crazy. Okay, that's the end of the electronics section. The next one is the beauty section. The first thing I have on here is the lounge um, brush dryer thing. I actually have it, it's right here pretty big honestly it's it's really nice though I really like it um the next thing are a big set of bath bombs they're rated like five stars I believe and um, they're on Amazon the launch is on Amazon too um yeah so the bath bombs are really pretty and um you know I I just thought they were cute um the next thing is the Sephora must-haves um, little box thing. I thought it was pretty cute, a good look, a good looking gift. So I put that there. The next thing is makeup brushes. I think they're like $69. And um, they're on Sephora too. Sorry, I'm not looking at the camera. I'm looking at the list. Um, the next thing is a gua sha and roller. And I believe that's on Amazon too. That's on Amazon because there was one like, I think there was one on Sephora and it was, if I remember correctly, it was kind of expensive. I honestly don't know. The next thing is a colorful palette, um, colorful makeup palette, eyeshadow palette, and it's beautiful. I actually was looking for, like I have a colorful palette by Carity and in that palette, it doesn't really have a red. It has like a dark orange. It's like a scarlet -y color and I wanted a red. And so I looked at this colorful palette and it has a red in it. So I really want this palette. Um, I don't need it, but I really want it. So it's on my list as well. And the next thing is a neutral palette. It's a Morphe palette, I believe. And it's just like, if you don't really like the colorful palette, if you don't wanna like range out and stuff like that. So it's from, um, it's from Morphe. Okay, the next thing is a makeup brush cleaner. It's like a little silicone pad 
that has like different textures on it so you can like swirl your um, makeup brush around. I actually have it. I, um, I'm too lazy to go get it. It's in the bathroom. I have a wooden brush. It's made out of wood and then it has wooden bristles. It's supposed to be really good for your hair like um, with the oils and everything. I don't know. It's good at like distributing the oils in your hair. I don't I don't know. Okay. So the last thing on the beauty um, list is perfume. I did a bunch of research. Um, this one's on um, Urban Outfitters and it's the Noir Distill. It's the best, like um, most talked about in the comments section. Um, it's the Gourmand Eau de Perfume fragrance. That's probably not how you pronounce it, but it's okay. Um, so yeah, that's that's the last thing on the beauty section. The next section is random. The first thing on the list is a wristlet. I got it at Target. I couldn't find it uh, there when I went again, so I just found it on the website. It's it's this little wristlet, and then. Um, you know that it comes with this little handle and it's it's so cute honestly it's adorable um the next thing is crochet stuff i just tagged hobby lobby um in the link because i have a bunch of yarn and um needle um crochet needles from them because i went one day and i really wanted to learn how to crochet and my mom bought it all for me <laughs> It's really hard to crochet, if I'm being honest. Um, there's the, the single crochet, the double crochet, the half double crochet, the magic circle, the um, granny squares. Um, it's insanely hard, honestly. Like, it's crazy. It really, um, I haven't crocheted in a while because it's so, like, irritating, honestly when you don't get it right. Um, the next thing is a bullet journal. I actually have a bullet journal that I haven't written in in like a while. Um, my mom actually got me a second one uh, that I've just made into a doodle, um, a doodle journal because I'm not even close to being finished with the one that I have. Like, um, it's just, you know, Comment if you want a bullet journal, to um, a bullet journal tour. This is the one I have. It's dark green. It's really pretty. Um, and then my mom got me this black one, and I've just using been using it as a doodle journal. This one's really pretty too. Um, yeah. Oh, the next thing is stationery. I got some stationery from this company a while ago. The um, the site is called Blick. And then the uh, the link is called dickflick.com. So you can buy all your stationary needs. Um, the next one is a pencil pouch from Amazon. I don't have this one. I actually have two from Target. But I thought this was a nice looking pencil pouch. It's rated really well. Um, the next thing is a book bag. I actually have this book bag, but it's in the closet. I don't want to go get it. Um, yeah, it's it's a really durable, nice book bag. Like, you can put your laptop in it. It's got like a, a leathery bottom to it, which is like really help. Like, it's really, it's just really sturdy, honestly. It's, it's really nice. And then next I have a clip-on tripod. It's what I'm filming with now. It's like screwed it's not screwed it's like um tightened on the desk and then you just have the cord out and then you like it's got like a, a little clasp that you put your phone into the holder um the next thing is a satin pillowcase i would say silk pillowcase but those things are like hundreds of dollars and your girl doesn't have that so satin is the next best thing uh, i think this one is on amazon um, the next thing is a Sherpa blanket. It's from Urban Outfitters. I really like the black and white one. Um, it's really cute, honestly. 
they have some mushroom ones too that I feel like a lot of girls would probably get. The next thing is a initial necklace. It's from Etsy. It's very dainty. I really like dainty jewelry. It's very cute, honestly. Oh, the next thing is a candle. I've actually got a few candles on here. It's the it's by the PF um, Candle Company. It smells so good. I actually got it from Urban Outfitters, but I found it on Amazon. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. It's the Amber and Moss one. I got it for my boyfriend for his birthday a while back. This one is an anthropology candle. This candle was rated really well. Um, pretty much everything on here was rated well. The next thing is a candle set. It's from Sephora. I think it was rated well. Honestly, I don't remember, but um, yeah. The next thing is an Urban Outfitters candle. And this one sounded good too. Um, the next thing is a bee keychain. It's like a little bee. Um, it's like an enamel -y keychain. And um, it's just a bee. It's so cute. Um, the next thing is a pet keychain. And it's, um, you like send a picture of your pet and um, they make their little face on a keychain. It's adorable, honestly. Oh, the next thing is candy because Christmas has the best candy other than Halloween, of course. But this one I love because you can only get it at Christmas. It's the peppermint kisses, like the Hershey peppermint kisses, the um, red and white ones. They are delicious. I haven't had them in like a year and they are like one of my top favorite candies. Like um, for Halloween, I like candy corn. I know I'm one of those people. And then for winter, I like peppermint kisses because they're bomb. Um, the next thing is a Yeti tumbler. A lot of people want like the Hydro Flask or um, the Stanley one. And I've just got the Yeti and I love it. It's it's really nice. It's great. Like phone case. I tagged Casetify. I actually don't have a Casetify case, but they look really pretty. So I added it. One day I'll get myself one. Um, I'm not um, sponsored or anything like that, which doesn't matter. I'm cool with it. It's fine. Um, but yeah, like, yeah. The next thing is an experience. Um, like years ago in 2016, I got me and Ryan uh, tickets to Cage the Elephant and it was such a good show, like so good. And um, that's why I tagged Ticketmaster so you could get tickets to a concert or something like that. Cause it's so fun, honestly. That was my first concert that I went to was Cage the Elephant. And it was really nice. Um, the next thing is a wooden lap desk. It's like, uh, I actually have one, but my mom got it at Goodwill. This one's from Target and it's just like a wooden, like the top part isn't like plastic, like some of the lap desks are. It's like, it's wooden. And then the bottom is like soft. I don't know. It's a really nice looking desk. Um, but yeah, I, I looked for one because I love mine, the one that I use. Uh, and nobody ever has one, like, you know. I mean, it. it's nice if you don't have a desk, is basically what I'm saying. The last thing is a warmy animal. It's like, you take like the little pack out of it, I think, and you put it in the microwave, and then you put it back in. You can also put it in the freezer for um, cooling purposes. And I figured it'd be really nice for girls that are on their period, honestly. I don't know, like TMI, but still, like, it's really cute. Like, I put the really big one, the sloth one, there. It is beautiful, like, it's beautiful. It is adorable, honestly. So, if you're a girl, or it doesn't really matter what, what you are, honestly, you go get it. Thank me later. So that's all the gifts I have on here. Um, I hope you enjoyed this unique Christmas list that didn't have Uggs or the AirPod Pro Maxes or Hydro Flask or Stanley Bottles. All of the allure is gone, honestly. Um, yeah, like I'm not a hater or anything. I just wanted to make a video that wasn't 
extremely popular. I mean, no, 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 I want it to be popular, but I wanted the items to be kind of um, different. Um, so yeah, like, enjoy the video. Um, I already finished the video, why am I saying enjoy it? Uh, hopefully you found a gift that you wanna get somebody or get yourself. Um, yeah, that's all.